Example 1. Find the complete solution of the partial differential equation Px plus Qy equal to Pq. Find the complete solution of the partial differential equation Px plus Qy equal to Pq. Now we are going to use it's a first order nonlinear partial differential equation. We are going to use the Chapitz method to solve the differential equation. So before going to the equations, we may write the function as f of x y z p q equal to zero. That is p x plus q y minus p q equal to zero px plus qy minus pq equal to 0. Now the auxiliary equation is auxiliary equation is dx divided by minus fp dou f by dou p equal to dy by minus dou f by dou q or fq which is equal to dz divided by minus p fp minus q fq which is equal to dp by fx plus p into fz equal to dq divided by d small letter q dq divided by fy plus q into fz equal to d phi by 0. So, this is the auxiliary equation. Uh, equation. Then we have to find the fx, fp, fq, fz all the partial derivatives of the function px plus qy minus pq equal to 0. Now fx derivative of the function with respect to x p then fy derivative of the function with respect to y with respect to y treating the remaining functions are constant f y equal to q then f is it uh, f p f p is equal to x minus q derivative of the function with respect to p treating q and x are constants then f q similarly f q is equal to y minus y minus q since px is 0, derivative of px with respect to q is 0, the remaining is y minus p and f is it, derivative of the function with respect to z. So, since there is no z term, we can write f is it is equal to 0. Now, next time, we will replace all those values to the auxiliary equation general equation that is dx divided by minus fp fp is equal to x minus q equal to dy divided by minus fq fq is equal to y minus p y minus p okay which is equal to dz divided by minus p into fp fp equal to x minus q minus q into q into fq fq equal to y minus p y minus p which is equal to dp divided by fx into fx is equal to p so p plus fx plus p into fz fz is equal to 0 now dp by p plus 0 which is equal to similarly dq divided by fy fy equal to q fy equal to q so q plus q into fz fz is equal to 0 which is equal to d phi divided by 0 now using this auxiliary equation we will find the solution or we will try to solve the values for p and q. Now let us consider this pair 
dp divided by p equal to dq divided by q now integrate both side integrate integrate both side you will get log p equal to log q plus integration constant some c which implies take the exponential both uh, both side implies e raised to log p equal to e raised to log q plus c log q plus c which is equal to e raised to log p equal to p equal to e raised to log q equal to q into e raised to c so i can write e raised to c as e raised to c as some constant say a a into e raised to log q equal to q so p equal to q a q p equal to a q then substitute p equal to a q in the equation p x plus q y equal to minus p q to get the value of q value of q now p x p x p equal to a q now a q x a q into a q x plus q y q into y minus p equal to a q so a q into q a q into q equal to 0 a q into q equal to 0 now take q as a common factor q into a x plus y minus a q equal to 0 implies that since q is non-zero a x plus y minus a q should be 0 now which implies that a x plus y minus minus a q equal to 0 or equal to a q a x plus y equal to a q or q equal to a x plus y divided by divided by a q equal to a x plus y divided by a and p equal to a q which implies that p equal to a q implies that p equal to a into a x plus y divided by a a a cancelled so p equal to a x plus y p equal to a x plus y q equal to a x plus y by q now we know that since z is z is a, is a function of x and y z is equal to z of x y any function of x y we can write dz is equal to p dx plus q dy now i am going to replace value of p and the value of q that is p equal to ax plus y and q equal to ax plus y divided by a to the equation now dz is equal to p equal to ax plus y now ax plus y dx plus q q equal to ax plus y divided by a into dy now multiply throughout by a a into dz dz equal to ax plus ax plus y dx plus a a cancelled a x plus y now a into dz uh, equal to a into a x plus y dx plus a x plus y into dy multiply throughout by a a dz equal to a now a dz is equal to a x plus y i can take as a common factor a x plus y into so the remaining terms are a into dx plus dy a into dx plus dy a dz is equal to ax plus y into a dx plus dy 
now ax plus y since ax plus y let let it be uh, some u then u equal to ax plus ax plus y ax plus y equal to u then derivative of ax plus y derivative of ax plus y equal to a dx plus dy equal to du now a dz equal to u du now integrate both side integral a dz is equal to integral u du which is equal to integral of a dz is equal to a z which is equal to integral u that is u square divided by 2 u equal to a x plus y now u square by 2 that is a x plus y the whole square divided by 2 plus integration constant say b integration constant b now the solution of the differential equation partial differential equation is a z is equal to a x plus y the whole square by 2 plus b that is the general or complete solution of the nonlinear partial differential equations.